Logan. Today we're continuing with our star scorecard. This is the cheat code 5.2a. This is video two for this cheat code. So we're going to work on just quick review. Uh, ah, ah, there we go. <laughs> we have to know the value of decimals and we have to be able to write, ex represent that through expanded notation. Okay. So what does that mean? What do you need to know? You need to know expanded notation is writing a number to show the value of each digit. And then place value, that's, that's, you know, the value of each digit. So if we look at that, we need to know what the ones place, the tens place, the hundreds place, the millions place. And the decimal, right, we'll just put it right here. We need to know the tenths, hundredths, thousands. So these are after the decimal, we have our decimal, tenths place, hundredths place, thousands place. The thousands place is the third, third um, digit in the decimal place. Here we are, just writing all of those values on top of every digit, the place value, okay? Now, let's go to the next four questions and then we'll be done. Felicia, Felicia wrote three and 29 hundredths on a sheet of paper. We know what and is, right? That's our decimal, so three and, three and decimal, three. Oh, C is not our answer. Three and 29 hundredths. So we just have to write the number 29, right? And it is only two place values <coughs> because it's in the hundredths. So B is our answer, three and 29 hundredths. How is Felicia's number written as a decimal mark your answer? You have to be able to, with, with cheat code 5.2a, you've got to be able to know how to write, use words to describe these numbers. And wrote the numeral 17 and, look, 83. It's just a simple 83, right? But there's three decimal places. One, two, three. It ends in the third. 83 ends in the third, so it's got to be thousandths. That's it. How is Anne's numeral written in words? 17 and 83 thousandths. <coughs> Is that it? It's that simple. And the number, 8 and, here's our decimal, 25. So there's 1, 2, 3 decimal places. So it's going to end in the thousandths. 8 and 25 thousandths. What is the number in the tenths place? <coughs> tenths, hundredths, thousandths. Tenths, hundredths, thousandths. Okay, tenths. So, zero. A. Last question. Okay, this one's kind of tricky. A bank received a check for 2,000, right? So, we'll just write this number. $2,609. Oh, so there's a zero here because 609. And here's our decimal. 75 since. How is this number written in expanded notation form? 2,000, all right, so 2 times 1,000. Great. All of these are the same, so that we're good. 600, so it's not 6 times 10, so it's not H. We know it's not H. Is there a, ten, a, a tens place? No. 9 is 1, so 9 times 1. It's not 9 times 10, because that would be 90. It's not F. All right, then seven times point one. Yes, that's it, because we're in the tenths place. The seven is in the tenths place. And then five times point oh one in the hundredths. Our answer is G. As you're taking your test, please write down stuff on paper. All right, when you do your lessons, when you take your star test, always use pen and paper, pencil and paper. Make some scratch work. So, you guys have a great day. See you next time.